The headlines may be familiar, but their numbers are striking. Disease outbreaks can occur anywhere, anytime, with consequences that can shatter communities. Emergencies of all kinds, conflict, disasters, can cause lasting damage to people's health. Today, 130 million people are affected by humanitarian crises across the globe, and they cite health as one of their top concerns. The World Health Organization is coordinating assistance, delivering medicines, medical supplies and vaccines to people in hard-to-access areas in the midst of conflict. As demands to meet emergency health needs increase, the World Health Organization's Health Emergencies Program aims to help countries prepare for, prevent, respond to and recover from emergencies quickly in a more predictable, dependable and accountable way. As Director General of WHO, I'm committed to building an organization with the culture, systems and resources to lead the response to outbreaks and other health emergencies. I am taking some fundamental changes to enable WHO to do this job well. I am creating a single new program for health emergencies uniting all our outbreak and emergency resources across the three levels of the organization. The new program is designed for speed, flexibility, and rapid impact. The Health Emergencies Program will draw on the World Health Organization's experience and expertise on all kinds of health risks in emergencies. Add operational capabilities building on the World Health Organization's traditional role of setting standards and providing expert advice. Establish common procedures to work seamlessly with existing global systems and partners for both humanitarian and outbreak responses. Accelerate implementation of the international health regulations so that countries are better prepared to deal with health threats. Dedicate more than 1,000 staff worldwide to work on emergencies. And it will place the World Health Organization in a stronger position to lead and coordinate the international response to disease outbreaks more effectively. With the support of member states, the World Health Organization has committed to move quickly to create the health emergencies programme we all want to see, so that we can deliver rapidly and effectively to save lives and protect the health of people at times when they are in greatest need.